Uh, before the accident, um, I was very busy, here, there and everywhere, walked a great deal, was able to make all sorts of arrangements without thinking. But since the accident, you have to do a great deal of thinking before you can even go out the front door. My name's Margaret Rogers, I'm 68. Two and a half years ago, I was go uh, walking along the road with my granddaughter. The lights were um, on red for the traffic to stop. So we were walking across and I don't remember seeing or hearing the truck. I remember them waking up on the road and somebody talking to me. And again, it was complete darkness after that. They gradually brought me around to tell me that I had lost one leg and that my granddaughter had died instantly on the road. Like anybody else who reads about people get compensation, you think, oh, lucky them, they'll be able to live the high life. And it sounds really good, but the reality is that uh, as you get older, uh, in any case, without having a disability, uh, you're going to need a lot more help, a lot more adaptation, like an electric wheelchair and all the other equipment, uh, walkers, wheelchairs for inside the house, uh, the bathroom being adapted, uh, say doors being widened. So all those take all that takes money. When I first met Maggie Powell, Royds with the King, she was able to reassure me that she would do the best she could for me, that she didn't want to go into too much at first, um, because there was a, a great deal to do, but she would wait till I got stronger. Um, and that helped. it took a load off my shoulders basically. If you haven't got a specialised solicitor, you will be continually on the phone, continually stressed, continually, continually anxious. And Maggie was able to take all that off my shoulders. And I trusted her completely. I haven't felt foolish or uh, worried about speaking to her. She reassured me I felt secure that it would all come together in the end. So yes, it's been vitally important to have a good sister.